iPhone 7 major improvements might include a waterproof chassis. The Galaxy S7 hints claim that we might see the return of expandable storage, and this might be the right time to get yourself a new Nexus smartphone or tablet. I'm Jaime Rivera, and uh, can you believe I was just called racist on the recap because I hate Mondays? This is Parker Now Daily. The official news today begin with HTC, or should I say cyber deals, as uh, Black Friday and Cyber Monday are the thing. And uh, the company has just started announcing its deals, starting with a $240 price tag for the Google Nexus 9, which is a great price tag for a tablet. But in addition to that, you also get the option for the One M9 for as little as $390. Now, there are a lot of cool options out there, and we'll actually have two separate videos on that very soon. But uh, so far, this deal is actually rather nice. And speaking of Nexus devices, we know that a lot of you went crazy over the Google Nexus 6P, and so did we. We actually loved it in our review, and uh, even though a lot of you were struggling to get the phone because they ran out of stock really quickly, it seems that the company has just figured it out, at least for Europe, and there are rumors that they're also figuring out within the next few days for the United States. And it makes sense, again, with Black Friday and Cyber Monday, so stay tuned for that. Now, I do know that some of you are in the market for the new Lumias, and right now you can only get the Lumia 950, but uh, for those of you interested in getting it at a Microsoft store that apparently is going to happen on November 26th, so stay tuned for that. But if you want to get Windows 10 Mobile on other devices that are not Lumias, it seems that that uh, Xiaomi uh, Mi 4 is actually going to get its own build of Windows 10 Mobile in the next few days, probably a week or so. But uh, the rumors are rather strong. Link to the description for full details as, yeah, this is probably another option, even though, uh, well, the rest of the older Lumia should be getting it as well. And yes, the iPhone 7 rumors continue, particularly with its build. We've got analysts already predicting that uh, since the iPhone's success was proven to be to a certain degree waterproof, apparently the iPhone 7 will use this as one of its major selling points. Apparently it is going waterproof in a full deal when it comes to its chassis design. But in addition to that, apparently there will be variances with the plus variant this time, as Apple will apparently stick to two gigs of RAM for the iPhone 7. And then the iPhone 7 plus is apparently going to have three gigs of RAM with some added extra features that we should be reporting on as we learn about more rumors. And finally, the very hot news today have to do with the Samsung Galaxy S7. We are expecting this lineup of phones to happen early next year. And uh, number one, well, we hear that expandable storage is making a comeback. Finally, apparently the company got the memo that, yeah, even though their phones were cool, the design was cool, people didn't really like the battery life nor the lack of expandable storage. And in addition to that, it seems that the, the Edge variant is actually going to be curvier. We're not exactly sure how curvy or what they mean with that. We're not sure if it's going to be flexible as for the rumors that we talked about earlier, but hey, it leads me to the question of the day. Uh, would expandable storage be important to you on the Galaxy S7 or did it pull you away from the Galaxy S6? In my case, I'll be honest, it's the reason I stayed away from the Galaxy S6, but surely I would love the Galaxy S7 with expandable storage. I am struggling with the Note 5 because of that, but leave us a comment down below. We'd love to know what you think. Friends, as always, you know the drill. If you want to get the news earlier before this video is filmed, make sure you follow us on fuckingout.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. And follow me on Twitter, Jaime underscore Rivera, or on Instagram at Jaime Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thank you very much for watching. We will see you tomorrow.